Welcome to your wonderful Wednesday Shave of the Day! Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving and welcome back. It's good to see you. In tonight's shave, I am using my Tierre Izar. This is the number 69. It is a 6 8 blade that is quarter hollow, made in France. Very cool. And for our soap tonight, I'm using Stash Soap Works, and this is Kira. And this is just a fantastic scent. Down in the description, I have the scent profile there for you. All right, so you can check that out. Now, I've had that blooming, so we're gonna go ahead and pour off that bloom water, put it on as a pre-shave, yeah. And oh, what a wonderful scent this has. It is so good. And I just work that in as a good pre-shave, get those whiskers all nice and hydrated. I did just come out of the shower as well, which is really benefit. Now for a brush tonight, I am going to be using, we're going to get most of that water out of there. All right, my Omega 10,098. And now this is just a fine brush. It really is. That's a big old bore brush, as a matter of fact. So let's go ahead and get this brush loaded up. All right. So hopefully you are having a great week. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it is hump day. Yeah. The middle of the week, midweek shave. So we are going to just go ahead and slap another one out and get it going quick, maybe. I hope. We're going to see. Yeah. I'm trying to shorten these a little bit if I can, but we'll see how it goes. All right. Now, I think we are there, it looks like, on the soap. This is fantastic soap, by the way. So I'm going to just go ahead and clean up around that bowl, just like normal. And we're going to put most of that on the brush. And then the rest, just like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you haven't tried using this as a pre-shave, you know, you, you can give it a shot. And then that way... Uh, you don't actually have to buy a pre-shave and this soap is what you're going to put on your whiskers anyway so it won't have any adverse effects all right look at that ain't that beautiful oh yeah nice let's get our lather on mm -hmm. yeah that is so good yeah hopefully you are getting good shaves yeah, maybe even some great shaves, right? I know I have been getting some really great shaves. Tonight, I don't think is going to be any exception, especially with that amount of beard growth. I have been busy, 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 busy. A lot going on. All right. Now, yeah, get that like that. Now we're going to put some water on this. This soap can take water, quite a bit of water as a matter of fact. So we're going to kick it up now. I like putting it on nice and pasty. That way I know I have got more than enough soap. And then I can just add water. And Look at this. Look at this. Isn't that beautiful? Check that out. That's great. You know, I can just keep adding water until I get it exactly where I want it. Yep. Which is always good. Yep. 
All right, look at that. Isn't that nice? Mm -hmm. That is so good. All right, there we go. Now, get those hands dried off. All right, now, come this Friday, I have a new Straight Razor Edge Friday special, and those come out on the first and third Friday of every month, so you need to check that out. This is actually gonna be a special Straight Razor Edge Friday special. This. Friday, okay, so make sure and tune in. It is going to go live at 7 o'clock a.m. Eastern Standard Time here in the U.S., all right? And this is going to be a YouTube premiere, all right? They let us uh, do that, and we'll have uh, a live chat as we watch the video for the very first time. So stop on by. Be in the live chat. I'll be there and you know we can talk and, and you can give me uh, your take on what's happening and how it's going and all of that and we can just say hi and we can hang out until uh, the video is over. All right. So that will be this Friday 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time and it's going to be a Straight Razor Edge Friday special something by the way that Keepros turned me on to. And I think it's going to be interesting for everybody. All right. So now I also get my ideas for the Straight Razor Edge Friday specials from you. So down in the comments, leave me a question, a comment, a suggestion, maybe even an idea for an upcoming Straight Razor Edge Friday special. And we will get that going for you. All right. All right, this is pass one, which for me primarily is with the grain. Let's do this. There we go. Nice. Okay, let's get that blade cleaned off. Yeah. All right. Looking good. There it is. All right, very nice. Yep, this is really a good razor.
and absolutely fantastic soap as well. This has got really good cushion for a straight razor and uh, nice slickness. So it works really quite well for me. Just mowing through those whiskers. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? That is so good. Oh, yeah. Doing what a razor should do. Yes, it is. Yep. All right. There we go. Pass one complete. Yep. Looking good, too. Looks good. Feels good. Let's get that rinsed off. See how we did. Oh, marvelous. Absolutely marvelous. And really, with this soap, again, all you have to do is get it wet. And you got nice residual slickness there. It really, it's amazing. All right, now, let's do the half pass. Now, nah, <laughs> the half pass. Oh, I'm getting ahead of myself. All right, we are doing pass two. You know, it just, this feels good enough. I could get away with doing the half pass and be done with it. But I've got this brush loaded up with a nice amount of soap. And I really want to use it. And I want to enjoy it. I do. Mm-hmm. So we're going to just keep going. Yeah, we are. I'm going to put a little more water on that. Again, this soap can take it. And I just really like a nice, good, thick lather. Especially uh, working with a straight razor. Mm-hmm. Look at all the peaks on that soap. Isn't that beautiful? That is so good. Really is. Now, if you are new around here, give me a hashtag new down in the comments. Let us know who you are and uh, we can say hi to you as a community. It has been really cool. We've had several people do that and I really am enjoying it and I'm enjoying you know, I'd, I'd like to have more interaction with you as well. All right, so uh, go ahead and down in the comments, give me a hashtag new if you're new around here. I do Shave of the Day videos every Wednesday and Sunday, so stop on by and check those out. 
And down in the description of this video, I have got a ton of links for uh, videos and playlists for straight razor shaving and honing. If you're interested in that, check that out as well. All right. Now, this is past two. So for me, that's primarily going to be against the grain. Let's do this. All right, now get that blade cleaned up. We're going to switch hands and get the other side. Yeah, nice. Okay. Nice. All right, excellent. Now, let's get this side. There we go. Looks like it may hit a little bump right there. Yep. No big deal though. Not a problem.
There you go. Pass two complete. Yep. And it did feel good. Now, we're going to get that rinsed off. Oh, yeah. Oh, those cheeks are nice. Yep. Oh, that is so good. It is. All right. Now get that dried off a little bit. And now it truly is time for the half pass. Yep. Now, if you haven't seen the half pass reveal, go ahead and click on that card. And that may be helpful to you. All right. Let you know a little bit more of what we're doing. For me, primarily, this is all I need to do is and against the grain pass on my jawline and my neck, and I'm good to go. Yeah. So, that, that will do it for me. All right, looking good. Now, go ahead, get that going. Uh, maybe let's go ahead we're gonna put just a little soap on that it's not a big deal like I say all right so now this is the half pass let's do it let me find that here I am getting ahead of myself tonight Oh yeah, nice shaver. Nice shaver, and I got some good soap to go along with it. Can't beat that. Cannot beat that combination. Oh yeah, nice. There we go. Now I get the blade cleaned up. There you go, another shave in the books. Yep. And I think it's a good one. We will find out. Get this rinsed off. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's nice. Oh, jawline and, and my neck, brilliant. Absolutely. Very nice. All right. Now, we go alum everywhere.
and that'll be good for that little spot we hit. Like I say, no big deal though. So, as you can see, it's not a problem. Mm hmm. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and dry that off. There we go. Now, for aftershave kind of thing, I'm going Thayer's, and this is the Lavender Witch Hazel. Yep, I think it's going to be very nice with this soap. Got a nice floral hint, and it's going to work really well. Mmm. And you can put that everywhere. I don't think you can go wrong with that Thayer's. Yep. Oh, awesome. Awesome stuff. And for our kind of cologne thing tonight, here we go. Panad Clubman Musk. Oh, yeah. A little sweet note in there to also match that soap. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. Nice. Oh, yeah. That is good. That is really good. And we're going to top the shave off with Nivea Poche Balm. And this is good stuff. Repair that skin. Take care of yourself. Excellent. All right, there you go. Now, you can click on this card to see why you can't hone a straight razor. Might be interesting. Click over here to see my latest video. Click down here on the video specially picked out for you. Click over here on me. Subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.